three and has been a big presence on this Buckeye back line for a long time. But going back to Maryland, look at Saxon Wolcott in goal. Less than a goal per game from their opponents last year. Stuart Baines. Give and go. Stuart Baines across the middle. And it's Van Hooklem with the left foot just sending it wide of Trejo. Good build up and the first real opportunity today to score for either side. Yeah, great passing on this opportunity. Get a look at Stuart Baines with it on the left side and then goes back and forth with Cole there and 3-2-2 two and two in the Big Ten right now and they have 11 points and they're trying to play to get higher in conference. Beautiful ball down to Grinstead. He couldn't cross it and find a team. It off to Grinstead. Pakoda, Adetakin. He's got an on-running Samways. Samways with a touch. Samways dribbles towards the baseline. Advancing, looking to score, so it looked like he hesitated there a little bit. Adetakin sends it in, right-footed curler. Velios, or Sullivan, excuse me, gets a flick on it, and it's cleared by Costable. They there to defend. Roberts chips it in. Easy going that time. Low. As we mentioned, Last day of the regular season here in Big Ten play. Bilo deep down the near touchline finds Pakota cutting in front. And Defender there. So Leon Cole, the freshman midfielder from Germany, will take this right-footed kick. Flicked on. Ball not out of danger yet. Still bouncing around in the air. It's shot on goal, and it's an open net finish for Bjarne Thiessen. The ball hit about four or five different heads inside the six yard box of Ohio State. And in the end, there was no trance, chance, excuse me, for Max Trejo here off the deflection and it's shoved home by Teason. Yeah. Throughout this first half so far, Connor. Yeah, I mean, his speed really allows him to do a lot of different things. Pakota tries to find an angle, can't. That ball's deflected off a sliding Buckeye in front. I believe that was Tommaso Vila and it's gonna be a goal kick Max Riley deep in Ohio State territory, just outside the 18-yard box. Abe with a right-footed curler, and that one is going to go over Trejo's head. Long run for Van Hooklem. Left-footed cross into the box. No trouble that time for the lanky Drew. Yeah, that was a hard hit to Tanner Creech. Now the free kick in. It's flicked out of the box by the Maryland defense. To Stuart Baines in the near touch line. Stuart Baines slicing, dicing. Stepping over, going to the touchline. He's taken down hard, and it's going to be a goal kick. No hesitation. Adetikin, it's a good one down the near flank. Adetikin stepping over, cutting back towards the middle. Left-footed shot in the box. A sliding tackle, that time by Kolvik, does the job. Terrapin's not out of danger yet. It's Samways lofting one to the back corner, and it's off the top of the crossbar. If that one was just a hair lower, Andrew, this is a great chance from Samway. Cole to take a right-footed kick. It's in on Trejo, who has to adjust last minute, diving to his left, and he's able to make a save off a skip. And on this wet turf, that was no easy task. Here's a good sidewinding punt all the way up to Andre Roberts, who's running forward. He's got a Dedekin in the box, leaves it in front. It's Creech. Creech bangs it off Walcott, who makes a great diving save outside his six-yard box. And Maryland... What's crazy to me, Connor, is that won't count for him as a save, but it was definitely a save if you look at kind of how the game is playing out. Flicked in. Roberts got it! And he's got the equalizer for Ohio State. A miscommunication by the back line. And the man we were just praising, Saxon Walcott, the freshman goalie, leads to a 1-1 game right before the halftime whistle here in Columbus. And there's the equalizer they're looking for. Adetikin playing that one in, headed off of Maryland and gave Roberts a perfect chance rising above the defense. He's giving up some inches. Adetikin right back to him from Wooten. He gets slid tackled into, no call, and that will be the end of the first half of play here in. Oddly enough, which is something you don't often see in any sport for any team for that matter. Interesting note there. Donnie away with just under 38 to play here in a 1-1 soccer game. Adetikin flicks it in, it's deflected. And a good diving save by Saxon Walcott. The deflection actually helped him there. It brought the ball back towards his dive. 
and he's able to make the play. Get another look at it here. Adetikin tried to split it through the middle. Nitzel sends it in. It's a header across the face of goal, and it will be fizzled out of end players into that 18-yard box, and Abe certainly has the run-up of a long throw. It's high and lofted. Just outside the six-yard box, ball bouncing around and headed clear. Corner. Maryland still in possession. It's Cole. Two Buckeyes are setting to check in. It's Parker Grinstead coming back into the game. He started this contest. And now a misplay by Walcott. Adetikin's got a wide open net. And it is going to be a tragic mistake for Saxon Walcott, the freshman goalkeeper. And Michael Adetikin nets it home for the go-ahead goal to make it 2-1 Buckeyes here in Columbus. What a break for the Buckeyes there. Adetikin, it was just him in the net there for most of that time. Wolcott came pretty far out there and tried to make that stop, but after the play, you could see him in a heap on the ground. He just kind of loses it with the back foot there, and Adetikin was able to get by and get a pretty easy one there. And Wolcott was just in a heap there on the ground after that one. You could tell he was really feeling that mistake. Working on DeVries, Velios to Pakoda, who's onside, chips it across a little bit too much time. Max Riley near touchline, puts it on his left foot, and Donnie Williams heads it out of. Anwana Ajiman threading a banana ball through, trying to find Creech, a half to go. Sean Ryan walks it across midfield and finds Anwana Ajiman rips a shot. That was always going to be ambitious, but now Pakoda on the ball inside the 18. Gets it back to Anwana Ajiman. Pakoda, a left-footed shot, and that's going to take a slight deflection that time off of Kolvik. It's going to be a, an Adetikun corner coming up for the Buckeyes. Check this one out here. Deflects off the defender, and then... Well, here come the Terrapins. Max Riley distributing out wide. Capetti. Into the Ohio State 18 yard box. Capetti chips it forward to Riley. Riley rips one on the ground. Briefly mentioned earlier about Ohio State's success last season as Adetikin is on the ball once again. Pakoda is wide open and he is definitely onside. Pakoda in on goal and a beautiful sliding stop that time by the young Saxon Walcott coming out of his net to make the play. Pakoda gathered up the reach. Chance here on the kick. Grinstead peels it with the right foot. It's flicked on, and Walcott alert and ball still bouncing around in the air. No one can corral it. People running into each other all over the place. It's Connor DeRoche ripping a shot, and he scores! Connor DeRoche, the senior from Dublin. He'll slide, he'll enjoy it, and so will the entire Ohio State team and Coach Brian Mazanov. Connor Board. Connor DeRoche getting a storybook goal here on senior day. He's only played one game this year, save for this one, and gets his first score. Man, that's got to feel good, Connor. A left-footed shot beats Walcott, who was a bit out of position, but really nothing he could do on this wet, wet grass we've got out here at Jesse Owens Memorial Stadium today. Coming years, they're going to be a power once again. Maryland usually one of the best teams in the country, and now Roberts finds Grinstead, who has a data can with, and Grinstead shoots, and he scores! Parker Grinstead grittying on the Maryland Terrapins and making this a 4-1 game and effectively extinguishing the Terrapins' hopes of potentially making a comeback push, Connor. What a run by these Buckeyes, Andrew. Three goals already in the second half of play here these Buckeyes are just pouring it on get a look at the footwork by Grinstead cutting it inside splitting the defense and getting that one just over there keeper Wolcott and then the celebration your side cross in Trejo gets hit that's going to be a foul on Maryland as Trejo was going up to claim the cross coming in from the graduate student just the lead with Lawrence Wooten, two prolific guys in this offense. 
Ball sent in that time by Pakota off the quick corner. Pakota has it once again, right footed cross. Too much. And it's a long throw into the box, high and lofted. Ball still bouncing around. And that ball is an attempted shot attempt. At the very least, win or lose, draw, whatever, they were gonna stick in this eighth spot, but chances are they at least move up a little bit in the standings. And the final whistle has sounded here in Columbus. Peter Van Ewen takes one off the face to end it, unfortunately. But the Buckeyes get the victory as you see Connor DeRoche and Ashton Bilo walking off the field all in smiles. It's a 4-1 victory for the Scarlet and Gray who improve